Old school hip hop showed the kids a thing or two Sunday night at the Pepsi Super Bowl 56 halftime show. The original gangsters Snoop Dogg and Dr. Dre performed with Drez Menti Eminem, the queen of RB hip hop Mary J. Lige, and rap star Kendrick Lamar, it marked not only the first time hip-hop artists were the main performers for the halftime show, but also presented Generation X with the opportunity to see if their dance moves were still da bomb or if they were totally bugging to think so. And since the game was played at Sophie Stadium in Los Angeles, naturally Snoop and Dre kicked it all off with the next episode and got us in a California love mood. Surprise guest 50 Cent then showed up to perform the all-time favorite birthday anthem in Da Club. Then it was time for Blige to take the stage with her emotional hits, Family Affair and No More Drama. She was followed by Pulitzer Prize winner Lamar, surrounded by dancers dressed in black and wearing Dre Day sashes. The powerful performance appeared reminiscent in strength and style to Beyoncé's formation during her halftime appearance in 2016. Accompanied by a band with Anderson Pack on drums, Eminem was up next with Lose Yourself, which, of course, caused the crowd to lose it. Eminem ended the song and took a knee, a gesture made famous by former NFL quarterback Colin Kaepernick as an act of protest against police brutality and racial discrimination. Then it was time to return to Dr. Dre, who appeared to be producing the entire performance from a soundboard on top of a set referencing a South L. A. Neighborhood, to take to the piano before reminding us that he's still got love for the streets with some bars from Still D. R.E. featuring Snoop Dogg, and that is how you show the young heads that the old heads have still got it.